because we got to shoot him from behind. I think, I think we're okay. okay. Uh, should we shoot from the front? Whatever. Yeah, we're, I think we're cool this way. Okay, so we'll just stand on this side. All right, All right so here's what we're going to do. Uh, Emmy, you're going to sit over here. And you're going to use that little, cu uh, little cup. And I'm going to use a spare cup. This represents the reactants becoming products. This represents the products reforming the reactants. Now we're going to start talking about reversible process where the products can become reactants and the reactants become a product. Most of the time, when we do a chemical reaction, we see an arrow that goes one way. Now we're going to start seeing a double arrow. You notice on the, on, the, on the board, I have a double arrow up there to show reactants can become products and products can become reactants. This shows that equilibrium is possible. Without telling you what equilibrium is, I want you to tell me when M and I have reached equilibrium. Now this represents the total amount of reactants to start with the total number of products to start with. Emma's gonna scoop as much water as she can. I've heated the water. I put a little oil and a surfactant to make our, our pour, and I forget it. <laughs> it's gonna defoliate our skin at the same time. Oh my gosh, Metro, I'm not. Well, in any case, the point being is Emma's gonna scoop up as much water as she can, and I'm gonna scoop as much water as I can, and we're gonna pour equally. And I want you to tell me when we've reached equilibrium. So here we go. Oh, it is warm. Here we go, rocking and rolling, or just easy listening, or jazzing, or just tapping off beatly. Okay, now what's happening? The reactants are, are definitely going faster than the products, yeah? yeah? I'm using up my reactants. We're pouring at the same rate, but obviously I'm doing what? I'm pouring more, so the forward reaction is going faster than the reverse. Now the reverse isn't stopping, it's just that the reverse is not going as fast. Keep going. We keep going. Nothing stops. Why would I stop? I've got reactants that are combining. So no, you thought equilibrium is when the reactants and products are equal. That is not the case. But you know what? Most people think that. It's the biggest mistake. We haven't reached equilibrium yet. Please tell me when you think we have. I think you're on to something. We're pouring at equal rates. It's a pretty boring demo at this point, right? What do you say now, Herschel? Good answer. Because we did the levels are wide. Ah, something is not changing. Equilibrium is pretty boring. Equilibrium looks like what? Nothing is happening. Now we... Ah, there's a reason why. So my friends, we're about at equilibrium because... Tell me why we're at equilibrium. We're pouring the same amount, which means... The amount, stop for a second. The amount of reactants and products are now staying constant. We can, we can keep doing this till the cows come home, if you have cows, okay? And if you did, I don't think they would come home. But the point being is stay in the barn. But the point being is you can do this all day, and these levels are not going to change because, okay, I am, well, empty yours, taking as much water as Emma is now. Almost, almost. Give or take. Okay? Sorry. <laughs> that will be fully your skin. It'll be nice. Because of the acid in it. Then it'll hurt after a while. Okay. So the, the, the point of the demo is if I, if I did this more carefully, we waited a little longer, this would fill the cup. So we were basically taking the same amount. And you're right, whoever said it, I couldn't scoop up any, an, an, any more. So I was taking the same amount. At that point, we we're, were pouring back the same water. And that equilibrium is two things. The rate of the forward equals the rate of the reverse. We were pouring the same amount. She was producing reactants as fast as I was producing products. And therefore, 
It's boring because the amount of reactants and products now stay constant. Yes? Is, um, like, do they, the amounts switch? Like, there was more, there was like... Well, more. initially it was higher. The four reactant was faster, but then I eventually slowed down to reach her. But, like, now, um, was there as much as it is on that side as there was on that side? I don't know, and it doesn't matter because this is the position we're going to stay in unless you disrupt the I, equilibrium. I, I okay? So, two things. When the amount of water or the rate of the forward is equal to the rate of the reverse, we're pouring the same amount and when these stay constant. Thank you. Caitlin, thanks you. Bye, Caitlin.